Melissa, you're a little bit different in your data kind of knowledge and acquisition for your customers. What's the common question your customer comes and asks you? So most of the questions are going to be very specific, mm -hmm. but I think that there is a general pattern for all of the questions that I get, and that's the existential question of how do you define an experience? Okay. And that's what we're really trying to do here is, is measure uh, something that is qualitative and make it quantitative, and, and how do you measure that? Um, so that's uh, what we do here at Conviva that, that I think is really exciting and, and interesting. Um, and I think where the industry has come in the last couple years is I think we've been really focused on the networking and infrastructure side um, where, for example, the industry benchmark on rebuffering was more so around 2%. And now it's at like 0.2%, mm -hmm. which is yeah. amazing. And so I think we're really looking at um, redefining um, how we measure that experience um, as engagement. And, and I think um, almost everyone has mentioned at engagement at least once. Um, and so, uh, yeah, I think that's, that's really the question is, how do you define engagement and, and how do you define quality and experience? Now, when you're saying when you're talking about engagement, are there kind of specific personas or buckets that you typically see? That's interesting. Um, I think that um, for the 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 way that I would first break that down um, is just going to be your live and VOD, um, and it's going to be our, if it's VOD, is it movies or is it episodes? Mm -hmm. um, because the biggest uh, question there to me, I think, is do you have bingers and are they auto playing? And is your recommendation working effectively enough that your auto play is capturing at least 60%, right? So that at least 60% of the time they are just using the auto play and they'll continue to binge to the next episode. Okay. 